How do I search databases? Databases are a quick and easy way to find articles and other credible materials on a topic. You can get to our databases by clicking on the Articles and Databases link on the library's homepage. Here's the Articles and Databases page, with databases listed by subject. Some databases are general, covering a wide variety of topics. Others are subject-focused or subject-specific. They contain citations to articles primarily about that subject. A good rule of thumb for beginning research is to start by searching a general database to get a basic sense of the information available. Then use a subject-focused database to find more in-depth information. Academic Search Complete is a good general database to start with. It's located under General and Reference. To search a database effectively, it's helpful to start with a clear idea of the research topic. Next, formulate a search in a way that the database will understand, a strategy frequently called Boolean searching. Suppose the research topic is how transportation choices affect the environment. Instead of a question, pull out the main ideas in the research topic and combine them in the blanks, transportation and environment. There are a variety of options available for narrowing the search on this page. When starting research, it's a good idea to leave these as they are, unless the assignment or project specifies limiting the search to a particular range of dates. When you're ready, click Search. These are the results of the search. Keep in mind that different databases will sort the results in different ways. Right now, the results are sorted with the most recent first, which is fine in some cases, but frequently a relevant sort will deliver better results. Click on Date Descending Sort to change the sorting to Relevance. Now the results show some promising articles. Particularly good ones can serve as a place to find some clues to help formulate more and possibly better searches. Click on the title of the article to see more information about the article. This will take you to a page called the Full Record. The Full Record contains important information. Here's the article's title, the authors, the source information, including what journal, magazine, or publication the article comes from, important for bibliographies, and the abstract, which is a summary of the article. Something else to note here are the subject terms. Look to see if the main ideas from the research question are here. If so, great! It means the search is on the right track. If not, look for synonyms for the search terms that can be used to formulate another search. For example, environment is not one of the options here, but environmental aspects is. Let's reformulate the search using that term instead of environment and search again. Here is the revised search. Results for this search will be more specific. There will be fewer results than before, but they will be much more targeted. Selecting more terms from the subject terms can narrow the search even more if needed. For example, emission control or sustainable development. Keep in mind, though, that adding terms to a search reduces the possible number of results. To recap, when searching a database, remember to start broadly using just the applicable nouns from the research topic. Using the results to adjust the search can help return more precise and useful results. If you get stuck or have questions, please feel free to consult a librarian.